Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a grocery haul for you. I have a haul from Costco. This is the first time we've actually done a huge shop from Costco. We took one of our family members um, Costco cards and just kind of went crazy. Um, a lot of the Rush supermarkets where we live are just ridiculously crazy busy and there are crazy queues and so much is out of stock. So we figured that we'd go to Costco where there's just so much more stuff um, so that we could get just like a good shop. You'll see in this haul, we didn't really um, bulk buy anything. Nothing we like bought crazy amounts of pretty much everything was either one or two things. Um, <laughs> bar the corn, because there's only like four in each pack and there's five of us. So yeah, this is for a family of five. Um, all of us are pretty much... I want to say adults by my brother who's 14 but he's like a growing boy so um you know we all we're all now exclusively at home so we do obviously need a few more bits and bobs just thought i'd quickly show you the frozen stuff before it gets put away that we just need to quickly put that stuff away um we got some garlic and herb marinated king prawns they look delicious um a couple of packs of hash browns we go through these super quick so i think we only got like two or three packs um the aberdeen angus um quick fry steak and this was on offer. I think it was like £5 off. So we literally paid £10 for all of these, which is incredible. Two packs of British lamb loin chops. Two packs of chicken breast fillets. And they are huge. Um, two packs of the... What is this? Aberdeen Angus stewing steak. And then a pack of the Aberdeen Angus beef steak mince. And then we got... Some of the hummus with olive oil dip. Four packs of mozzarella. Um, some halloumi. Or like, they just call it grill it grilled cheese, but I'm guessing it's halloumi. Um, one pack of chicken wings and then two packs of chicken thighs. And then we got some Caesar salad, like a Caesar salad kit, which should be good. It's a really big size as well, and you get like the sauce and everything else. So yeah, that was all of the stuff that needs to quickly go in the fridge now. So I'll just start over here. Um, it is actually my brother's 14th birthday on Monday. So we did get just some pastries for our breakfast and just a snack throughout the day. Um, we got the mini pastry assortment, which is kind of the ones with raisins and um, custard and stuff like that. And then the other one is just with, um, it's like the croissant. So we just got the ones with the chocolate and just the regular. I personally like those ones. I'm not a big fan of these. So yeah, we got two blocks of cheese we got the um, mild white cheddar and then just a thing of the finnish uh, dishwasher cleaner then we just got some of these plastic containers with the lids us like so many other people i'm guessing have so many of these containers but we don't know which lid goes with which box so these are nice because they are commercial quality so they're extremely extremely good quality um reusable and leak resistant so there's 25 in a pack um and they are bpa free as well um two packages of cherry tomatoes on the vine um a pack of the pitted green olives big thing of the organic extra virgin olive oil and i think this is the one that you can use for seasoning uh it doesn't say it on there but usually yeah we do get that one some premium quality grapes they're just the red grapes and then we've got the green grapes some plums i think i'm just going to go around this way we got two packs of olives and um, olives <laughs> lemons and these lemons are absolutely huge normally the ones that we get like in the regular supermarkets here are so so small so these are absolutely massive two packs of these um sun is it sun kissed sun kissed smiles um mandarins then we got i'm just gonna go around the edge i think <laughs> we got two packs of these um small pasta sort of yeah pastas um, I don't know what they're actually called, I don't know, yeah, that's all in Italian, <laughs> is that the type of pasta, oh, who knows, two packs of those, um, one pack of carrots, one pack of bananas, uh, one food service grade foil, um, I think, I don't know how many you get in here, 30, oh wow, you get 30 of them in here? <laughs> that's really good um we got a whole package of the i think they're the green giant are they yet yeah, the green giant sweet corn we got a big five kg 
bag of rice. We usually like to get the Tilda brand, but um, they didn't have any left. So this is just whatever that says. <laughs> Aunt Caroline. Uh, so hopefully that's nice. Um, now, this was a bit of a luxury purchase. And this was something that I bought for myself. Um, I love Fro Rochers, but they are extremely, extremely expensive. Normally, one of these boxes is like six or seven pounds. So... Um, of course, they were a lot cheaper in a pack like this, and I think they worked out to be around £3.50 each box. So that was great. I thought I'd treat myself. Um, not an essential at all. Um, one box of pears, two boxes of oranges. We got some cling film. I think this is only one in this pack, but it's just a really 400 metre um, pack. And then we got two packs of strawberries we got one big bag of royal gala apples they're personally my favorite type of apples but these ones are huge usually we get the small ones um one packet of these? seedless cucumbers for snacking i've actually never seen these before um yeah i'm not a big fruit or veggie person so that will be for the rest of my family um a pack of avocados for my sister um, I thought I'd try this. I've never tried it before. I'm a big fan of oven pizzas. I think they're the best for like quick and easy meals. Um, and this one is just the organic margarita pizza. Um, and yeah, I'm guessing it's just a regular pizza with really nice. I like the base on this one. They did have another one, but the base wasn't as nice. And this is a three pack. Then we got a pack of five of these um, baguettes that you put in the oven. We have already dug into it, which is why there's one missing. Had that for dinner. It was really nice, actually. Literally put it in the oven for like 10 minutes, if that, and it becomes really nice. It tasted super fresh as well. Two loaves of Hovis wholemeal medium bread. This was another guilty pleasure purchase item. Um, it was, so it's like this huge, so there's three packs of eight four finger bars and i think there's like 24 in total here or something like that i don't know my maths isn't great and um i think it worked out to be like 20p or 20 pence per like four bars which is incredible because in the shops you would pay anywhere from like 70p upwards so that was cool um i then got some or we then got some sweet bell peppers um and then four packs of three packs sorry of corn which we are planning on corn on the cob which we're planning on actually putting on like the grill for like a barbecue and having that which because there's five of us like that one pack will go in one sitting so one and one <laughs> um so yeah we got that as well then we got um because it's my brother's birthday on monday um and his favorite drink is j2o we did get a crate of these and it's crazy because one bottle of j2o um in i don't know like a pub or a restaurant will cost you two or three pounds and this whole case of four times six was like 10 pounds so it's such a good deal um and then i love apple juice and for some reason i love it even more when it's in a little carton so i did grab a whole pack of these and i thought while i'm working from home these will be nice just to have like once a day as like a little sugary pick me up um, these were, I'm not sure if I mentioned before, but um, oops, uh, there wasn't many things that were one per person, but the toilet roll and the kitchen roll were along with the spaghetti. I didn't see anything else that was one per person, but those were. So we just got one thing of um, tish, uh, kitchen towel and you can see there's just loads and then one of the toilet roll and i believe there's 14 here for the toilet roll i'm not sure how many for the kitchen roll then we did get i don't know where the other one's gone but we did get two bags of um these gardens of elverdon uh potatoes and the craziest thing is all of these potatoes cost one pound i literally don't know how we've never been properly to Costco to do like a big shop considering that we're a family of five but that was crazy um I did get a box of um a 60 pack box of crisps and you get quavers what's it's and just a variety pack of the monster munch so yeah I got that for just working from home snacks and then lastly just got a pack of six harpic um like, I think these are toilet cleaners. 
or the, yeah the toilet cleaners so yeah guys that was pretty much it um i don't remember the exact total but the ballpark figure was around 400 something um so i will put that in the screen now um it is definitely gonna last us a while considering that there's five of us and considering that everybody is either off from school or working from home so we will, we will go through this probably in about two months we do have obviously a lot of meat as you saw in the previous clip um and we do have things already in the freezer and the fridges and we've already got stuff so yeah that is what it's looking like i hope everyone is staying safe and please if you have any grocery hauls or like you've got you've been preparing to kind of self-isolate please do send me your videos i love watching hauls i love watching how people <laughs> what people kind of put together and what people like to shop for it always gives me ideas and inspiration so yeah have a lovely lovely rest of the day where you are have a safe day and i'll see you in the next video bye